It'll be the San Antonio Spurs going up against the Los Angeles Lakers here in Staples Center. Kevin Harlan here, and I'm joined by Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg with David Aldridge on our sideline. And the Spurs start out with the ball. Parker dishes to Duncan. To the paint, here's Robinson. A slam dunk by Robinson. And the Admiral, David Robinson, a big time threat to dunk it down. Can't give this seven foot one center any room down low. Here's Bryant. Lays it up off the glass. So much excitement, Clark, surrounding a season opener. Think these players have any game one jitters? Absolutely. I mean, it's normal and it's human. How could they not? I mean, They've been waiting for this moment all season long, so I'm sure it's tough to keep those emotions in check, but you got to make the butterflies fly in formation, man. The Spurs shooting their first free throw of the game right now. Shooting for That free throw, good from Bowen. A big highlight of Bowen's game is his defense, but I think that really speaks to his commitment and effort in general. I mean, this is a very smart basketball player. Here's Parker. First quarter of play, one minute played. Pass to Duncan. Here's Bowen. Pass to Jackson. Just five on the clock. Shoots over Bryant. Jackson misses. The shot's there for him, and he's got to take it. I don't care if he doesn't convert. That's a shot he has to continue to take. And it's in there. Or he's such a selfless player. This guy just makes winning play after winning play. The Spurs have gone two or three here to start out the game. Robinson left side. Duncan, the pass to Bowen. Parker kicks to Duncan. Inside, it's good. The assist this time from Jackson. Look at how comfortable Duncan is inside the paint. He knows those close range angles like no other. He's special in that regard. Here's Fisher. Takes it off the glass. That kind of energy and hustle on the glass usually produces good results. Parker against Fisher. Parker's shot is off. Lakers have gone four or five from the field so far. Here's Kobe. Count that bucket. Kobe's so athletic and smart. Hard to slow this guy down. I mean, he plays through contact well, too. Pass to Duncan. Here's Bowen. Guarded by Fox. Duncan scanning the floor. Unable to get that one. Not sure what, what the D was doing there. Clearly a breakdown. You can ill afford to give a guy like him that good a look. Well, that's just a demonstration of terrific ball skills from Kobe. Avoided the defender and gets it to fall inside. There's the pass to Duncan. Kicks it to Parker. Jackson in the corner. And the three ball is good. Boy, that was a thing of beauty by Parker. The Lakers in the lead. Fisher way outside. Trying to answer back, but that three is off the mark. Here's Bowen. Guarded by Fox. Bowen the pass to Robinson. Score the basket, his second of two attempts. Yeah, I like the interior game of Robinson. Really does a nice job with getting deep position and then going to work. Kobe against Jackson. They get it back. Gets it out to Bryant. No good from outside. Got the defender off his feet with the pump fake, but couldn't knock it down. Pass to Bowen. Takes the three. The rebound by the Lakers. Here, matched up against San Antonio is how they'll tip off the new season. They take on a team they knocked out of the playoffs last season in the conference semis. Would you suspect a little bad blood or bad feelings from the opposing side? They better be ready to scrap. Jackson misses. 
And here's O'Neal. He'll bring it up for Los Angeles. And Bryant gets it to go. Kobe has such confidence. Feels like this guy can score whenever he wants to. Spurs trail by four. Parker double teamed. As to Bowen. Shoots the three. And the rebound collected by Ori. And I thought that was going to drop. It looks good from here. Duncan against O'Neal. Over Duncan. Again, the Lakers. This is where you let O'Neal eat. Actually feast. Feed him inside, and you'll get paid off for it. And San Antonio calls the first time out of the game. Walker's checked in for Los Angeles. Shaw comes in for Fisher. So San Antonio going with an almost entirely new group here. Will is he checked in for Robinson? Rose comes in for Duncan. Smith checked in for Bowen. And Ginobili subbed in for Jackson. 105 left to play in the first. Let's a floater go. Tries to save it and out of bounds as the Lakers gain possession. Speedy Claxton. Los Angeles leading by six. And man, is this team on a roll right now offensively, Greg. So fun to watch. They're playing with so much confidence, which is why they're tearing it up on this end. Kobe comes with a double team. Back to Claxton. Ginobili looking around. Rose a screen on Walker. Out to Smith. Shot to stop the run. Duncan, the pass to Smith. The shot, no good. Walker with some nice D. Los Angeles has gone one of three from beyond the arc so far in the game. Spurs trail by nine. Smith on the wing. Outside Rose. Passes it to Ginobili. Floats it up for Rose. Hammers the alley of crew. Ginobili, such a solid passer. Seems to know whenever one of his guys is wide open and gets him the ball. And he was able to put it up in time, but doesn't fall. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers bringing the quarter to a close with a seven-point lead. They're pounding the ball inside, and that's where they've gotten their best production tonight. Right back after this break. enjoyed the broadcast so far halfway through the first half in this one and taking a look at the Lakers performance here what have they been doing or not doing in the game well they used the fast break to generate some easy buckets before the defense could get set and you know for them guys it's all about tempo keep the pressure on and do so as much as possible strong move to the 10 trying to get his guys going hard not to get motivated GA right when your teammate makes that kind of play you know, when you're looking to close the gap, you need guys who will take it upon themselves to step up, take the initiative, and make something happen. Now, here's Rose. And Ginobili wide open. He shoots. And that comes off the assist by Duncan. Ginobili's got his first bucket of the game, and he's on the board for three. And here's Kobe for three. Duncan grabs the rebound. Duncan's got his fourth rebound in this one. Here's Claxton. No good. That would have tied it. And guys, not sure where his head was on that shot. Not what this offense was designed to create. Not at all. I mean, that's where they want him looking for a teammate, not trying to do it on his own. He needs to share the wealth there. Now here's Joe. Back to Claxton. And he hits it to tie the game up. Claxton's got his first two points of the night. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. Again, the miss by the Lakers. The Spurs are gone three of four from the floor here in the second quarter. J. 
Ginobili with the three. A rebound by the Lakers. Their biggest lead of the game was nine. This game is finished. They'll be off to Portland taking on the Trailblazers. That'll be the first half of a two-game trip. Shaw passes to Manson. Nice D from Rose. Oh, that's terrific defense there. That's how you protect the rim. Bounce pass, Claxton. The pass to Duncan. Uses the glass to finish the way. Duncan's got his second bucket of the game to go. What a luxury to have Manu on your team. I mean, he's pretty much a 6-6 point wing. Always creative. So the Lakers call timeout. They're first. And Los Angeles with some changes. Morris checked in for Madsen. Fox comes in for George. And Derek Fisher is subbed in for Shaw. Fisher way outside. No good. And they can't put him into this drought. San Antonio's gone one or two on three corners here in the second quarter so far. And the foul is called. He intentionally grabbed him there for some reason. I don't know. Kevin and Kevin, all I can think of is that he's trying to slow the game down a mm -hmm. little bit. That, right. That's a stretch, though. Definitely a strange move on his part. Now here's Duncan. Jackson has the open look. And a potentially loaded draft class coming up. But the star of it all has to be the high schooler from Akron, Ohio, LeBron James. You know, I don't think I've ever seen a player as hyped as James. Almost impossible for him to live up to it. But he's as skilled as any player we've ever seen out of high school. Ginobili kicks to Robinson. Kobe comes with the double team. Back to Ginobili. To the left side wing. And here's Kerr from the arc. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Here's Fisher. And no good. Trying to use the glass. And it's Jackson with the ball, bringing it up for the San Antonio Spurs. Only given up two points this quarter. They double team Genova. Up again. He hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. And the Spurs lead by two. Well, you know, Duncan's too big and talented not to put a body on him. And he's always lurking around looking for offensive boards. Nice work to get it inside and draw the contact. Exactly. The defense determined not to allow the easy layup right there. They'll settle for making him earn the free throws. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for the Spurs. Their chemistry. That's what really stood out so far in this one to me. Look at the number of assists they've been able to rack up so far. Also, they're getting into the teeth of the defense. Points in the paint. Something coaches always love to see. Looking at who's out there now for the Spurs. Rose, he's checked in for Duncan. Owen comes in for Mono Ginobili. And Tony Parker subbed in for Steve Kerr. Walker's shot is off. And here are the Spurs. They've got a 13-2 run goal. And Kobe Bryant gets the whistle that time. That'll be his second foul of the game. Shaq is checked in for Walker. That's his second personal foul. Second team foul. Here's Robinson. Pass to Bowen. There's the three. And that's good. Robinson picking up the assist. Bowen's got the lead up to seven now for the Spurs. Bryant from way outside. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Bryant. One forty-three left in the first half. Here's San Antonio. They've gone on a 16-2 run. Not allowing much. Jackson misses. And Los Angeles guys uh, shooting just 39% from the field. Struggling to find that net. It's good, and the San Antonio lead has cut down to five on the bucket from O'Neal. Well, the defense tries to slow Shaq down inside, but emphasis on tries because O'Neal just too strong. The Spurs have shot just one free throw early, one for one in the game, and he makes the first. And Parker drops them both. Tony Parker, the Frenchman, is so exciting as a basketball player. I think it's because of his speed. He has blinding speed and excellent change of pace, too. 
and you could tell they had that play ready to go. Well done on the inbound. And he's got his first chance at the line here. Wound up shooting 85 from the line a season ago, which is an exceptional percentage. You know, he really did excel at the stripe. I mean, they couldn't have asked for too much more from him when it came to knocking down free throws. Now, here is Robinson. Back to Parker from downtown. And Shaquille O'Neal pulls it down. Lakers trail by four. Stolen by Robinson. And it's Shaquille O'Neal with the foul. That's his first foul of the game, and the bonus will go to the free throw line. He'll take his third and fourth free throw shots at the game right here. You know, this is not an area where they expect him to contribute. You know, he's a guy that shot below 70% last season. And we saw it last year, guys, because those numbers were so low. Teams weren't afraid to put him on the line where points were hard to come by for him. Yeah, well done to finish that one off. Spurs have gone 7 of 14 in the second quarter, shooting to the tune of 50%. Parker finds Rose. A rebound by the Lakers. Shaq's got nine rebounds now tonight. He nails it, and we're tied up. O'Neal's got six points in the quarter. Couldn't tell if they tried to foul Shaq there, but didn't matter. The Spurs shooting 43% from the field. Here's Parker outside for Jackson. Parker passes to Robinson. Here's Bowen. He has six. And Parker, here we go. It doesn't go for him. So a tie game here as we finish the first half. Live from the Staples Center, you're watching 2K Sports. And as we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard yet. Kobe Bryant really making a difference here. No problem fighting his way to the rim in this one. A lot of points in close. Yeah, you know what, guys? They gave him too many free runs to the hoop in the first half. I think they've got to be a lot tougher on him. Body him up. Be physical with him. And in that first half, we saw a pretty tight battle. We'll soon find out what sort of adjustments were discussed during the half. To the inside, here's O'Neal. That's good. And the assist goes to Fisher. Fisher's got three assists now in this one. San Antonio trailing here. Pass to Duncan. Here's Bowen. Guarded by Fox. Back to Duncan. And Duncan throws it down. Boy, that's a powerful throwdown by Duncan. He saw an opening there and took full advantage of it. To the middle. Here's Shaq. Count that as his seventh field goal. Nine drives. He's shooting 78%. Always fun to watch Kobe setting other people up. And it's Jackson with the ball, bringing it up for the San Antonio Spurs. They can look forward to San Francisco after this game and a matchup against Golden State. That'll be the second of this two-game road trip. Second half just getting started, about a minute play. In the corner, O'Neal with it. And Shaq with the slam. Boy, they keep feeding Shaq, and he keeps scoring. The big guy giving his team exactly what they want. Here are the Spurs with the ball. A two-point game. Parker double-teamed. On the wing, Steven Jackson. Duncan with the screen for Jackson. The Spurs need to get a shot off here. Count the basket. Robinson's got it all tied up now for the Spurs. And just a step ahead of the D in that possession there, making the pass. Nice assist. Here's Ori. A rebound by the Spurs. Duncan's got nine rebounds in the game. Getting it done. Here's Parker. Softly drops in the floater. Parker's got four this quarter. Yeah, that floater is another one of Parker's go-to shots. One that continues to befuddle defenses. Here's Bryant. Kobe going to work inside. 
And guys, the D has to show a little more fight on the interior than they did on that trip. Here's Parker. And it's Fox with the rebound. The Lakers have gotten four of their first five second-half shots to fall. 80% since the break. Wasted no time on that one. O'Neal's got 18 points in the game. And, you know, this is a pleasant surprise. O'Neal looking to expand his game with the mid-range jump shot. And uh, San Antonio shooting 47% from the floor. Getting it done. Here's Jackson. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Parker. Five points in the game. It, it really does make the game easy for your teammates when you can lead them to the rim that well with a pass. Pulls it from the elbow. Here's Shaq. Score the basket for his 10th bank. 10 for 12. 83% accuracy. Because Shaquille O'Neal is so big and so athletic and so relentless, it's really hard to keep him off the glass. Duncan at the elbow. Nice pass. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. He knew what he wanted to do all along. The teardrop. Here's Fisher. Good D by Parker. Spurs have gotten six of their seven shots to go down in this court. What a fantastic start to the half. Stolen by O'Neal. On the wing, Bryant. Elbow shot. Another shot. And O'Neal gets it to go. O'Neal's got 22. Really nice job to convert the putback opportunity there. I mean, he stayed with that play from start to finish. That's something we say about him a lot. Now, here's Parker. He's got eight. And Antonio calls timeout. Some changes here for the Lakers. Walker comes in for Orr. Shaw subbed in for Fisher. Otto Ginobili's checked in for the Spurs. Steven Jackson on the wing. Here's Robinson, and it's Robinson with the jam. A terrific pass there by Steven Jackson. We've got 148 left in the third quarter. And here's Walker outside. Sinks the three-pointer. Walker's got himself on the board with three there. Boy, Brian Shaw could have rolled that ball to his teammate. He was so wide open. Parker inside. The Lakers with the rebound. O'Neal has a two-pointer. Basket good. Now it's a five-point Laker lead. Major dominance in it come so easily for him. Fantastic at getting to his spots on the floor. The Spurs have gone 7-9 from the field to start this second half. Some tremendous shooting from them. Parker's shot is off. Lakers shooting an outstanding 53% for the game. O'Neal drives in. And he banks in the layup. O'Neal's got 16 here in the second half. Moving well on the dribble that time. O'Neal, remarkable athlete for his size. Parker kicks to Duncan. Here's Jackson. Here's Robinson. There's the dish to Parker. Stolen by Walker. Top of the key. And again, it's the Lakers. And creating a little separation here. Gaining some confidence. Yeah, you get the sense that they're going to start stretching this lead out a little bit. Here's Parker. They can't stop the run with that one. It's almost like he's trying to make things hard on himself. You know, he's just got to slow the game down, try to get some easy ones. And O'Neal gets it to go. And really the story of this second half, one team getting the shots they want, the other not so much. And that's why you have such a huge gap in the shooting numbers between the teams. Parker outside. Ginobili sets a screen for Parker. Just three on the clock. Doesn't go for him. Boy, you can just see the frustration growing on their faces. Nothing going their way. You know, guys, no denying it's been a rough pass. Shaquille O'Neal getting it done for the Lakers. They kept going to him again and again. And he delivered with a master quarter. Back to the action in just a minute. And we reach the fourth quarter in a game that may be already out of hand. Duncan with the screen for Ginobili. 
And there's the call on Derek Fisher. That'll be his second foul of the game. His second personal foul. First team foul. Passes it to Ginobili. Down to five on the shot clock. And Duncan throws it down hard. And, you know, this team depends on Duncan offensively because they know how great a scorer he is. Walker the pass to Fisher. Here is Shaw. That's good. And the assist goes to Fisher. Fisher's got five assists tonight. Big miscommunication on defense. He recognizes it and quickly takes advantage. Boy, the defense looks shell-shocked. I mean, they're on the ropes right now, on their heels. Kobe finishing the break. And he anticipated the play, and Kobe finished it on the other end. We played just over one minute here in the fourth quarter. Shot by Ginobili, and he gets it to go from the corner. Lakers leading by 11. It's Bryant, high post, working on Rose. Claxton with it. He's picked up by O'Neal. Uh, and a few more plays like that are all they need to make their comeback bid a real one. And Los Angeles guys uh, shooting the ball really well in this game, 58%. Here's Shaq, and the rebound goes to Duncan. Duncan's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. The feed to Rose. That shot missing. Walker with some nice D. That's not the type of opportunity he fails to convert very often. Count that one. O'Neal's got 30. Putting the team ahead of himself, Walker makes that extra pass to get his teammates a shot. Now, Claxton, a pass to Duncan. Smith surveying the D. Ginobili finds Duncan. That falls nice feed that time for Mano Ginobili. Ginobili's got five assists in the game. Duncan with that innate ability to shoot the basketball. Some changes for the Lakers. Horry's checked in for Walker, and it's Fox in for Shaw. And the wait is now from our sideline reporter, David Aldrich. David, it's all yours. Take it away. Guys, during that last break, I heard Phil Jackson as he talked with the team. He told them, don't look at the scoreboard. We have to play like we're tied. They want their team to sustain that level of effort. We'll see how it works out. Kevin? Thanks so much, David. And Kobe Bryant gets the whistle that time. That's his third foul of the game. Second team foul. And there's the call on Derek Fisher. And that'll be his third foul so far. And now only one away from being in the penalty. Yep, the next one puts them on the line, so they've got to be careful the rest of the way. And we're about three minutes into the fourth quarter. Steven Jackson on the wing. Duncan outside. It's Parker outside. It's all about his size for Shaquille O'Neal on defense, using that body to intimidate opponents. Stolen by Jackson. And here comes Jackson leading the fast break. And Kobe Bryant gets the whistle that time. That's his fourth foul of the contest. Here is Parker. Well, if you're just tuning in, welcome. We've got about three and a half minutes gone here in the fourth quarter. That one's in there. The Lakers lead is cut down to nine in the bucket from Duncan. Now, here's Fox. He's tightly guarded. O'Neal. And he tries off the glass, but it's no good. And it's Parker with the ball, bringing it up for San Antonio. Props in the layup for two. And that's just an all-star caliber move off the dribble by Parker that ultimately creates the shot. His quickness with the ball really nearly unparalleled. Spurs trail by seven. 
Jackson with it. Parker outside. This is to Robinson. Just five to shoot. Here's Duncan. And Duncan throws it down. How about the concentration from Duncan? Does it budge even in the biggest of moments? Here's Kobe. And good. Got the friendly bounce off the right side of the rim. Bryant's got 21 in the game. What a move showing off the handles there. And uh, San Antonio shooting straight 49% from the field. Parker with the bounce pass. A floater. Duncan can't hit. Los Angeles leading by seven. Shaq in the high post. Duncan is there. O'Neal misses. Now there's an example of good defense beating good offense. Here's Bowen. Goes back up. Back to Robinson. Money! Oh, and that cuts the lead to just five. This guy is a leader both on and off the floor. Robinson embraces drilling the big-time bucket for his team. And it's still a rare sight to see rebound numbers like the ones he's had tonight. Boy, he has put in some major work. He's earning his pay for sure. And now we've got the intentional foul. Here's Kobe. That one falls. And the Lakers lead by seven. Relentless in their approach, even with the game firmly in hand. And you know, until that final buzzer sounds, I mean, you've got to treat every possession like it's good. Four seconds left in the fourth quarter. Bowen, good. Well, Bowen is such a professional getting it done on offense when they really need it. Unable to get the ball in bounds. They get called for the five-second violation. And we have to take another glance at that powerful rejection. And that is a huge block. Given how close this game is, a stop like that was right on point. Time called here. The Spurs decide to talk it over. They're down by four. There's 31 seconds left to play here in the fourth. On the inbound, it falls, and he has brought them to within two points. Oh, you just love seeing a player with absolutely no fear. Cool, calm, collected, and confident in the biggest moment of the game. Yes. First free throw is good, and that makes it a three-point lead. Kobe with a chance to cause some heartbreak on the other bench. And so he drops them both. It's a four-point ball game. And that makes it a two-possession game now. Those could turn out to be vital free throws. San Antonio calls timeout. They're trailing by four. 27 seconds left in the game. Twenty-seven seconds left in the fourth quarter, and he's been a force on the glass all game long. Yeah, I love the way he's fighting through box outs, using his elbows. I mean, he's doing whatever it takes. And no good as the first free throw missing for him. We'll see if he can hit the second. Well, sending Shaq to the line here is on paper the smart foul. O'Neal might just make them regret it, and he ends up missing both free throws. Can't waste any time here. No, you need a quick bucket and then a quick foul. Robert Ory. That's his first personal foul. Fifteen foul. Gets the first, then narrows the lead down to just three. Bruce Ball. Taking two shots. Cannot convert on the second. That misses. If he hits all of those, they're feeling a lot more comfortable. But now, still a one-possession game. And now, an intentional foul. They need the ball back as soon as possible. Yeah, that's right. No other option but to foul and hope 
for some distance. Yeah, they have to extend the game. I mean, plain and simple. Use every second you can on the clock. So he goes two for two at the line, and it's a three-point game. Well, those free throws make things a little more simpler right now. They just have to guard against the three-pointer. They get the rebound. Parker kicks to Robinson. This would tie it. Oh, he couldn't make that shot go to force overtime. So it's Los Angeles taking the W in a close one. What a show they put out here at home tonight. I mean, these are those games that feel so great to win.